Hi everyone, Happy New Year. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Pick Your Team 4. Full Case 4 from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Nick's going to help us pop this open. Big thanks to all of these folks right here for getting into the action. If you see a little rooftop next to your name, that means you got this in a team random. I Capola with the Giants last spot mojo. So good luck to him. Good luck to everybody. Thank you, everyone, for getting in. We've been pulling some nice stuff out of here. Let me actually upload that team random while Nick's pulling out the boxes here. No, we like the Angels. You know, we're a brotherhood. Yeah, Sean. Oh, Sean no, you talk a lot of smack about my other teams. My yeah, Sean. The Eagles. Yeah, Sean. Specifically. So the team random's uploading. So you see that in a... Arr, oh, I was just going to try to hulk it, but I guess... It's not, not a hulk. All right. Good luck, everybody. Full case, pick your team four. What did you just do a team random of? Five? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So there is a team random for pick your team five, ladies Some and people, gentlemen. Four people will get packs. Four teams will get teams. Okay. And some of the teams are, you know, the Cardinals are in there, they're 300. The Giants are in there, they're 260. The Patriots are in there, they're like 160. The Redskins are in there, they're around 160. So there's some good teams in there. So they're like, what, five, six teams are like over the cost of the spot? Yeah, maybe. And then some other Or teams significantly like over the cost bucks, of the spot, um, yeah. Significantly, yeah. And then a few the teams Bills, that are about the cost of the spot. Bears, Bills, Cowboys are over the spot. So I'd say almost half. All right, so almost half will be over the cost of the spot. Ladies and gentlemen, some so people are getting packed, we so can squeeze in another contender's break tonight. In fact, how long did the other one take us, remember? So you're not totally guaranteed a team, but... All right, so this will take us only about 40 minutes with Nick's help. So that should bring us to around 8.30ish. L.A. time. Which leaves us with an hour and a half left in the broad. Yeah, an hour and a half left in the broadcast, which is time for one more contender solo that I can do. Which will take up, will probably be about an hour. And then we would have time to do something quick, like a 30 minute break. And then, uh, yeah, and then, and then that'll, that'll, be, our, that'll be our night. Andy Isabella leads things off. 38 out of 99. You see the uh, the die cut there. makes it look like a ticket. Rookie ticket autograph for the Cardinals. Richard Mathern got the Cardinals in a team random. Yeah, five is sold out, but we need to do a team random for it. Also, we'll, do, we'll randomize these top-bottom at the end of the break. Set that up there. There may be points here too, ladies and gentlemen, that will uh, that will randomize to one person in the break. Jeff wants to know who's going to win the Super Bowl. I'm going to figure out who's in there first. And there are points right there. Winner take all on the points. How far does Tom Brady go in the playoffs this year? Uh, yeah, five sold out with the team random, so I think we can do it tonight. Jacoby Brissett to 175. And Kalen Saunders, Kansas City Chiefs. That will be for Josh Pruce, who picked the Chiefs. But yeah, just Here keep in mind team that four. team random, some people won't be getting teams. So it's different than the one we just ran. Just because there's some higher teams, so I try to cut the price down. Bruce Anderson, Tampa Bay Buccaneers. That's going to go to Jeremy Anderson. Related? I'm going to say yes. 
My guess is that Jeremy Anderson is related to Bruce Anderson. Deontay Pamela Harris Anderson. could be related to Pamela Anderson too. Deontay Harris for the Saints, Dean. Dean Iwatake with that one. Didn't North Dakota State just win the divisional champion, uh, the division two championship? Do they really? I think so. They're like a powerhouse. D two powerhouse. Oh yeah, Sean's friends with Easton Stick. He met him at the. Uh, oh, I know. The, the club. Although I kind of like that nickname, E Stick. He's your he's your BF now, your boyfriend. It's cute. I don't, never be once left. <laughs> I, don't, I don't. I don't know what Sean's Sean's GF is gonna say about that. <laughs> <laughs> Sean's GF is gonna be like, "Oh, so you're gonna you're leaving me for Easton Stick, huh?" It's like it's Easton Stick, babe. Oh, uh, BFF. Oh, now he says that. Boyfriend forever. Wow, not even just boyfriend. Boyfriend forever. <laughs> Much to the dismay of Sean's girlfriend, waiting on the waiting for the ring. Oh man. And then she's just like, "What?" Easton Stick, you meet Easton Stick once. <laughs> he's just like on Sunday, he's going to the Chargers. Trayvon like, West I'm just going after a quick, you know, few <laughs> yeah, hours. It's like, there's a Chargers game. <laughs> yeah. G Lo, what's going on? Jordan Ellis to 99. Oh, she she got in, she got a pick with Joey Bosa. There's Eric Dungey. Was this planned, Sean? Did you know that they been were there, gonna be at this? Been there, done that. At this thing, or did you just? Uh, me and Joe or did you happen to run into him? Me and Joe got a picture with Bosa before he was popular. Eric Dungey, it's on like the rookie premiere. Eric Dungey for I Capola and the Giants. Juan Thornhill for Josh Pruce and the Chiefs. Oh, also, I think Sean and Rory figured out that. Okay. I think we knew this too, but I think they were. Uh, what is it? The helmets. Oh yeah. Very, I thought very it was variations. Like, oh, the website. This. Oh no. <laughs> like you know. No, just. But just everyone just wants to be part of Jaspies, Nick. That's what it is. They want to be so desperately part of Jaspies that they want to try to pretend that they, they work for us. It's like I get give, Mike give us the team, and, team like, suggestion. I'm at, like, just might as well work in the M cubicle. McDonald's, yeah. yeah. Might as well work in a cubicle? Is that going to say? Yeah. yeah, might as well work in, work in the cubes. Oh, wow, no clue. So they just, that's kind of funny. That's pretty cool then. I thought you were just stocking the Chargers. But it turned out that, that no, it was just an $80 open bar type situation for New Year's Eve and they... They all happen to be there. That's pretty cool. Wow, Vinny, that's crazy. You got the Wait, Kobe Vinny, too. you got the Kobe too? That Kobe was cool. Ooh. That was a cool card. I posted that. Wow. What a lucky dog. All right, there's Paris Campbell for the Colts. Stephen K with the Colts. Got the Colts and a team random. Yeah, redeem that Giannis, Vinny, and just wave it in Rory's face. Just take it to his shop. And be I'll like, be honest, Ha ha! I have, we hit the Jaspi store as redeemed. We haven't gotten it yet. All right. Next one, Jason. What's going on? No, no Miles Sanders yet. No Miles. Not yet. Philip Rivers to one seventy-five. Marcus Green, speaking of the Eagles, there's Marcus Green, rookie ticket autograph for Bruce and the Fly Eagles Fly. Jordan Alves, Chilo, that's like early 2000s gossip right there. Remember when Tony Parker cheated on Ava Longoria? He was like, how did that ever happen? Sometimes, sometimes a person just becomes a person. 
NBA players, you know. Jeff P. Yeah, well, yeah, they're always on the road. You never know. And they have, you know. There's Ola B.C. Johnson, 11 out of 81. I'm just saying. I mean, they go somewhere. The whole club stops, probably. 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 Don't know that firsthand experience, but I would imagine. Vikings. That, that goes to Conrad Boats. No, Paris is a notorious non-signer. Hey, here's Devlin Duck Hodges. Rookie ticket autograph for the Steelers. That will be for Michael Gallucci. Steel Curtain and the Steelers. There's Hakeem Butler. On-card autograph. Yeah, <laughs> like I was saying, people didn't. He, he did me. pull that back pretty far. To, I was saying he did cock that arm back to I was slam saying, it. If I had that one hand slam, you know, if I was the same weight, height, and athleticism as LeBron James, I'd be better than LeBron James. <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> if you hold on, I'm trying to wrap that my my head around it. If you were exactly the same size and talent level as LeBron, yeah. So you're just saying you're mentally tougher than LeBron yeah, James? Yeah. Okay. Fair. And I would stay in one city. I wouldn't go. Wow. Out. Even if even if your boss was a complete d bag. Yeah. Even if you wrote that letter in Comic Sans about. Me. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Maybe not LeBron, but like you know, someone who might not try as hard as he could, like James Harden. James Harden tries. Well, he, he goes, can't be that good. Those strip and not clubs, try. You know. Get, he gets in trouble there. Wow. Imagine if he didn't, though. That's what I'm would saying. He be like 40, I wouldn't be doing 40, that. 45 points a night? I might be doing that. I don't know. But if you're James Harden, you probably would be doing it. Yeah, I probably would be doing it more. Imagine all the extra service you get at, 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 a, at, a, at a club like that. Yeah. An adult exotic dancing club. It's like Michael Jordan. He was like gambling in his free time. Yeah, I'd do that too. Although Michael Jordan, he would, you know, he's like the most. There's Dax Shepard. Going to the Bears, Jody stacks Raymond. Actually, that's a variation because it has a helmet on it. We're, get, we're getting closer, Richard Mathern. Yep. Hakeem Butler, Isabella, and then the guy that throws him the ball. Maybe the Bruce Anderson Buccaneers. That's going to be for Jeremy Anderson. Did everyone hate Jessica Simpson for dating Tony Romo? Man, you're you're bringing back some old old gossip, some classic classic gossip there, Gilo. Are you taking a trip down memory lane? Patrick Laird. Like, remember that falling out between Ariana Grande and Jeanette McCurdy? Gilo's gonna bring that up next. Patrick Laird going to Ryan Reb and the Dolphins. Remember when Justin and Selena broke up? Well, just and then got back got together, for and then poor play. Ooh, ooh, Andy Isabella cracked ice. Seven out of twenty-three. Richard Mathern got the Cardinals in a team random. That's a nice one. Getting closer and closer. Yeah, he had some good games last yeah, year. He's a good player. High draft pick too. So. Cracked ice is always I nice. I don't get the variation, but I'm just gonna see see how it goes. I don't get the variation. So. What do you mean? I don't know how to spot him still. So I'm, I'm confused by what they said, but I'm just going to act like I know how to do it. <laughs> we just saw one. It'll have a helmet. Oh, okay. So, yeah, how do you do the Browns? That's the variation. What about the Browns logo? I don't know. Huh? We'll have to find it. That I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> they don't have any. People I don't know. People forget their logo is a helmet. It's just, it's <laughs> it's just, it's just a, a color. Orange helmet. Yeah. That is maybe... The worst and best logo of all time. You know, Mike McCarthy just looks like a Cleveland coach. I think he's going to get hired there. That'd be good. He's, he's a good grown-up in the room. He's a good fit. There's Devin Bush, the second. That goes to the Pittsburgh Steelers. 
Michael Gallucci with the Steelers. What you think? Which vacant head coaching position is you think the best? I think Cleveland's. What are the other choices? Dallas, New York no. Giants. No. Carolina Panthers. Maybe. Um, that's it, I think. North Carolina's nice. Yeah, but. Easton yeah, Stick. Good weapons, actually. This is uh, Sean's new best friend forever, Easton Stick. You didn't get the charge. 23 out of 49. Oh, he didn't. Jeff Peace did, though. He got him in the team random. Well, I guess now that Sean's friends with Easton, he can just get his autograph whenever he wants. Yeah, that's true. He can just get contenders' base cards and just yeah, have them. Yeah, every night. Oh, yeah. hey oh. End day. It's 2020. It's all right. That's a nice card, right? Jacoby there. Myers. Patriots. That goes to Mark. Mark N, who got the Pats straight up in this one. Jacoby Myers is their best receiver, maybe. Put a put a little uh, Lotto scratcher money on. Him, first touchdown of the game. Jay, there's Jace Sternberger. I think Cleveland, I get the stigma about Cleveland, but they have the best talent, I think. You'd be a legend if you want to deliver a Super Bowl in Cleveland. Legend. And Dallas, too. I feel like I don't want to deal with that owner. Well, the Giants, or the Cowboys, I don't know if you know. They haven't won a Super Bowl since 1996. <laughs> oh, yeah? That's yeah. Kind of Eagles fan going down Cowboys' his no, <laughs> memory I'm saying, lane. I'm not saying. I'm saying as an unbiased sports reporter. Oh right, 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 right. No one knows you're an Eagles fan here. <laughs> Stephon Diggs to 175. If the Seahawks beat the Texans in the Super Bowl, 601. I think I would take Cleveland. Yeah. I mean, just a, just a challenge of just... Because they've, they've got good names on paper. Yeah, I mean, Miles Garrett, if he ever plays again, if he doesn't hit people in the head with helmets. Defense is decent. Odell Beckham, you know, can turn around. Nick Chubb was the best running back, was, uh, rushing yards-wise. He won, he won the title for rushing yards. Oh, um, you, you know, you got some other good players, Jarvis Landry, and Joku, Baker Mayfield. I think could still be good. Yeah, you just get everyone together on the same page. That's that could be a great team. The Giants are good. I mean, could be good too. And the Cowboys. There's Brian Burns, Carolina Panthers going to Troy Rimmer. There you go, Troy. Good to see you. Carolina would probably be the the safest job, I guess. You know. It's not as media crazy as the other three. Because everyone just goes LOL Browns. The Cowboys are a media circus, and so are the Giants. Benny Snell Jr., 33 out of 99. We sold an Easton Stick car today. Maybe it was Easton Stick. Not like I would have known him coming in, but... Michael Gallucci, Steel I Curtain. I don't think I'd recognize Easton Stick, but maybe he bought himself his own part. It was a majestic patch auto. Easton Stick with the biggest Easton Stick PC? Yeah. Well, he's just buying his cards knowing he's going to be good at football. Whoa, he's so betting, like on, betting, on him, betting on himself. Yeah. What happens when, like, the quarterback of a team... As a wide receiver on his fantasy team, that's his wide receiver. You think he just feeds him? It's just like all of a sudden 15 targets a game for like this receiver. Maybe on DraftKings. Giants are a good team. I mean, you got Daniel Jones, Saquon Barkley. Otaro Alaka, 37 out of 50. Ravens, that's going to go to Darren Porter, the Porter House State, would be with that die coach. cut. I think Peyton would be a really good coach. Eli seems like he wants to just play starting quarterback. He'd like put himself in. <laughs> he doesn't want to be a backup. That's Raquel what. Armstead. He said he hated like mentoring him, basically. Yeah, that's not. I, mean, I think could. Josh McCown would be a good head coach someday, too. What about Josh McCowan at wide receiver, though? 
Eagles might have to Sunday. <laughs> no, that's what I'm saying. Karen Higdy, he's their, he's their emergency wide receiver on the Eagles. And that goes to the Texans. King D with the Texans. There you go, King D. Eagles would be fine. They won 42-3. People 42-3? Yeah. Why are you laughing? I don't know. Just the thought of Russell Wilson not scoring any touchdowns was kind of funny. They scored 16 points last time, so it's not like they put up a bunch of points. Now they know. Now they know how to how to beat the Eagles. I'm not predicting injuries either. I don't do that. Just completely healthy. I think Peyton should be a GM. Ooh, Pat Tillman. Out of 175. That is for the Cardinals. Nice Pat Tillman, Richard Mathern with that one. Zach Gentry. And they'll say it's all elementary for Michael Gallucci, Steelers. Lil Jordan Humphrey. Another one of those die cut autographs. That's pretty cool. 42 out of 84. That's going to go to the Saints. That'll be for Dean. Got DeAndre Baker. That is for the New York Football Giants. I Capola. Last spot mojo. Jody's one asking, wouldn't it be funny if Eli ended up on the Chargers? Yes, that would be kind of funny. Two redemptions. Two redemption box. And then Eli forces his way back to the Giants. Like, Archie Manning just like, calls yeah, him Archie Manning's just like, no, we're not going to do it. Or when David Stern blocked the Chris Paul trade. Oh, man. That was terrible. I like how they hide that. That's funny. Even oh, though they... like, it's one of their emojis. Huh. Isn't that weird? Yeah, why would they make us review? Oh, because it looks like a middle finger, I guess? Yeah, well, it is. Oh, it is. But, but they're the ones who put it on there. Yeah, so why not just not let you do, or do that yeah, emoji? I don't know. That's funny, though. <laughs> just ban shot for that? Yeah, just <laughs> YouTube just burns <laughs> his account. Bans him. We got Daryl Henderson, rookie playoff ticket RPS, going to the Rams. Jerry Bennington. Hmm. House? Rams house. Although well, they have a new house now. Oh, SoFi. Such a bad name. Yeah, it's kind of bad. And Miles Sanders, there he is. That goes to Bruce and the Fly Eagles Fly. Just too busy. Offensive rookie of the year. Too Miles busy. Sanders. I forgot. Miles what? Sanders, offensive rookie of the year, most purpose yards for a rookie. I think you forgot Thank that Josh Jacobs and Kyler Josh Murray Jacobs exist. Josh Jacobs to the playoffs. Give me a break. You think it was Miles Sanders that took the ra to the the Eagles to the playoffs? Part of it. No, Jordan cool. Howard's been out since week five. Carson Wentz. Miles Sanders. It's Carson Wentz actually playing sixteen games for the Miles first time Sanders. in his life. Tons of. He played the first year. Did he play all games? All all sixteen games? Yeah, he's only been hurt like once. All the time. Really? Injury prone. Glass Carson. Derek That's Carr what they call him. Little gl Glass Carson. Derek Carr hasn't <laughs> been good since he got injured. That's true. One of one. Jordan Brailford. Super Bowl ticket. Everyone knows Jordan Brailford. Jody got randomized the Redskins in the team random. Ends up with the one of one. Jordan Brailford. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! There's Drew Sample, Bangles, Jeff Peace. Oh, 
And thanks to Nick for ripping open those boxes for us. Makes us break breeze by a little bit nicely. Deontay Harris. Saints, that'll be for Dean. And the Saints. And apparently that's his first autograph uh, ever in these sets. So Deontay Johnson this football season. So value for him, Dean. A little bit on the higher side than what it would normally be at this point of the season. Rookie ticket autograph, Deontay Johnson. Looks like a variation with that little helmet right there for Michael Gulucci. Steel curtain with that one. Where's that waterfall at Staples Center? I don't, I've never seen that. All right, next stack right here. Got Mark Ingram, playoff ticket. To 175. That will be for the Ravens. D. Porter. The Porterhouse Stake with the Ravens. There's Zach Gentry. Ask the local Gentry. And he'll say it's all elementary. Try, try, try to separate them. Alize Mack. That's another Saint. Zach Gentry, of course, goes to Michael Blucci and the Steelers. Deshaun Jackson autograph. Is Deshaun Jackson playing this week? Boo. Oh, ooh, nice confidence, boss man. I like that. Deshaun Jackson. 22 out of 25. Boss man saying he's going to play next week. Sunday ticket signatures. And I can't wait till I have playoff games to go to. <laughs> 79 out of... Rashawn Gary, Charles with the Packers. Boston Scott, that could be the game changer though. Can he catch passes out of the backfield? He can, right? All right. Tucker, what's going on? Jeff's wondering what everyone thinks about Contender so far. I personally like Contender. This is like a pretty a relatively sort of flagship kind of product, if you want to put it that way. A lot like Bowman Draft Baseball is for for Tops and Bowman. So they usually do a pretty solid job with this. You know, when like when people talk about the Tom Brady rookie card, it's generally they're generally talking about the one out of contenders. So they tend to carry their held value pretty well in the long run. There's JJ Arthigo Whiteside for the Eagles. That's for Bruce. All right, a few boxes to go here. Sean likes it, just wish it has a little more color. There's Dwayne Haskins to 49. Yeah, I think if you like parallels, then you would certainly go with Prism football, Prism basketball. There's DeMarcus Christmas. But if you're just hunting for those autographs, contenders would be the way to go. Good grading opportunities here too. Uh, that goes to Justin Patterson and the Seahawks. There's Tristan Hill, rookie ticket autograph for the boys. That's going to go to Jeff and the Cowboys. Got randomized the Cowboys in the team random. Uh, 
We got another cowboy for Jeff. That's Mike Weber. All right, see you, Nick. Thank you. We got Cole Holcomb. It's for Jody and the Redskins. Another Redskin for Jody. Rookie roundup, Marquise Brown. 7 out of 49 for the Porterhouse stake. There you go, Darren. Nice. Hollywood Brown could be could end up being a legend in the playoffs. No, Sean's saying I mean same product, but basketball too. I was, oh, and more numbered and color. That's, yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah, basketball does have some more. Whereas football has five autos and then less color. Two more boxes to go. Hi, Todd Father and the Bears. What about the Bears? Aaron Rodgers to 175. There's Andre Dillard. That's for the Eagles. Variation autograph for Bruce. Jamel Dean, rookie ticket autograph for uh, Jeremy Anderson and the Buccaneers. Jimmy Moreland, rookie ticket die cut autograph, 21 out of 25 for Jody and the Redskins. Redskins having a really nice break. Tim Boyle from Eastern Kentucky. That goes to Charles and the Packers. Redemption. One more autograph, last box coming up. It's Drew Locke, rookie ticket RPS for the Broncos. Remington. Remington Steel with the Drew Locke. Remember Remington Steel, you guys? There's Drew Locke right there, redemption, and the last box. Back in. Ram Ingram with the top 10 in scoring 
We got Tyreek Hill to 99. Zach, John, another Zach, starting your Zach Gentry PC, Michael Colucci. It's like your third or fourth one there. There's Travis Fulham, 39 out of 84 for the Lions. Detroit Lions, Jeff. Got through the Lions, randomized him, the team random. Rock Yasin. Rookie ticket autograph for the Colts. Stephen Kendrick, uh, team random spot. Got the Colts in a team random. Joan Williams, Patriots. Rookie ticket autograph for Mark and the Pats. Oh, is that? Look at this. Draft class. One of one. Wow. wow. Boss man just popping in and say good night. Witnesses a Daniel Jones one of one draft class autograph for Ika Pola, who got the New York Football Giants last. Last spot mojo. Woo! That is nice. All aboard the Big Head Express. Woo woo! Wow. It's Contenders Basketball, Contenders Football. Both of these new releases that dropped today have been hot, hot, hot. Go and get it on jazpyscasebreaks.com. We'll, we think we have time for one more tonight, boys and girls. And there you go. All right, we'll do a quick randomizer. For the top bottom cards and all the points, winner take all on the points. So everyone has a shot at the points. We'll go top bottom on that. And we'll randomize each card two and a four six times. One, two, three. And six. After six times, Michael Colucci, there you go. You will get all the points. I think there's three 250-point cards right there. So those are yours after six. And then top bottom, one, two, three, four, five, and six. After six times, top cards will, top teams right here, will get these round numbers cards. So there you go, quick autograph recap. Juwan Williams, Rock Yasin, a lot of good stuff. Drew Locke. The Marquise Brown was nice. JJ Arthigo Whiteside, Deshaun Jackson was pretty cool. The one of one for the uh, Redskins, Jordan Brailford. Miles Sanders. That was Daryl Henderson. Easton Stick, Devin Bush, Isabella Cracked Ice. Delvin Hodges. That's Paris Campbell. Another Deonta Harris. And of course, Andy Isabel, and of course, that one of one, Daniel Jones, was pretty nice. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Another great case in the books for jazbeescasebreaks.com. This is Joe.
and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.